I mean, there's just no way you shouldn't be doing that, especially with his deck. You're going to be playing with his deck? I've been on this earth for 28 years, and in that time, I've become an expert at two things, and only oh. two things. The first one, live streaming. Oh, the other yeah. One, getting scammed. If you look up Ludwig Scam, there's a lot of videos that come up. Yep. Not all clickbait, I actually got scammed out of $100,000. So last night, when there was a topic involving both of these things, my interest was piqued. Uh oh. Because I think we witnessed the largest ever attempted scam live on stream, which so is far. a crazy thing to do. So let's get into the context. The first thing we need to find out is the person who is getting scammed, who is a person I think you'll be familiar with. We've talked about him on this channel before. It's Aiden Ross, yep. the biggest kick streamer in the world and one of the biggest streamers mm -hmm. in the world. And who did he get scammed by? None other than 21 Savage. 21. The artist who famously sings this line. How many niggas done died a lot? How many times did you cheat a lot? How many times did you lie a lot? Yeah. What do you expect? Confusing. Let's just keep up for a moment. If you don't know, a lot of rappers have been going on to streams. It's like yeah. one of the biggest ways to get seen by fans around the world and speak to them directly. There's huge streamers, right? So Kai has had people like Nicki Minaj on and yeah, recently yes. had 21 Savage on. There and they is. did a bit of gambling, right? Just Ooh. a couple of guys doing a bit of gambling. Nothing wrong with that. Ooh. They gambled over a game of Madden and the outcome was Kai losing $300,000 and then, and then doing this. Never, game. never bet money in private games, boys. Never do it. Don't do it. There's no reason to do it. But Dumbass. Dumbass game, bro. He was mad. He was mad. 300k is a lot, okay? So Kai lost 300k to 21 Savage. God damn. He is a millionaire, true, but I, but I think he was actually upset about that. I'd be pissed, so, too. So there's the context, okay? A lot, a lot of uh, uh, major artists, rappers, are going onto these live streamers' streams. Yeah. And, and one of the main things that Tony and Savage does on these streams is gamble with the people he is streaming with. Right. And he seems to relish it. I think he enjoys gambling, and I think he also enjoys winning. He's he a fucking hustler, man. Film the aftermath everything, of Kai's bro. outrage. I was meant to pull up Posted it online. This nigga Kai, bro. Everything, bro. <laughs> Fill me the man while it's down. Say Dada. Oh. Say Having Dada. him say Dada. Well, hey, Kai, you look good in the Crocs, so you got that going for you. Oh, so God. Conference, right? And this all led up to a stream that happened last night where 21 Savage went on Aiden Ross's stream. This is something that's happened before, and I think Aiden, at the outset of it, owed uh, 21 Savage some amount of money, like 20K. Yeah. Nothing major for these guys, but. A lot more money is going to be wagered throughout the course. Of I mean, twenty thousand dollars is a good amount of money. Uh, and so here's the start of it, where they're talking about it. Twenty k. How much you want to put up on this game? It don't matter. Whatever you want to put up. A hundred. We can bet a hundred. A hundred. Yeah. So if I win, you pay eighty. Yep. So for context, yeah, they're betting one hundred thousand dollars on a single game of NBA Two K. That's what they're doing right now. Which is a crazy thing to do, because if you know anything about 21 Savage is 5'11? Bro, next to Aiden, I thought he was like 6'5. What the fuck? Jesus. Oh, God, bro. Aiden Ross, mm. his come up came from the 2K scene. He's damn good at the game NBA. He's pretty not short, bro. He's also pretty damn good, but Aiden Ross, credit to him. Pulled off some pretty, pretty good moves. Down there one point. Eight seconds left. Kicks it out. Oh. Hits the dagger. All right. And Hunt and that's the thing, right? Is like, to be fair, Aiden immediately starts talking shit. Immediately, it's like, oh, I'm so sorry. You've got to give me all this money. So like, I don't want to hear about how 21 Savage is an asshole for doing that to Kai. Bro, Aiden did the exact same shit. This is just what you do pocket. after you and win a video game. And there, they played another game. Yeah, this is just nothing. what happens. Aiden won. He's at 200k. Then they played a third game, double or nothing, for four hundred thousand dollars. And Aiden was winning by so much that he offered Twenty One Savage an out. Uh, I'll tell you what. You owe me two fifty instead of four three eighty. You quit right now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> quit out right now. And I'll give you a one hundred fifty thousand dollars discount. That's Jesus, a nice thing to do. Jesus, man. And so twenty one savage finally accepted it, 
and then they moved on to other forms of gambling. And here's where the scam comes in. See, right? this is the thing, right? Is like Aiden might be the master of the realm of video games, but whenever you get into the real shit, the fucking, uh, you know, sitting in the garage with a pack of cards, marked cards, this is like you're going into 21 Savage territory, you know? So we're, we're fully caught up to speed. 21 Savage. Aiden oh, Ross shit. Gambling. 21 Savage owes Aiden Ross like $250,000. And Aiden Ross even... After the dice was loaded. You discount, don't have to load dice. You got to roll them. You, you put it with your, your finger like this, and you drop it. You, you have to plan, is it going to do... It's the same as like throwing an axe, right? Or you throw a knife. Like whenever you throw a knife at something, you should plan the amount of spins that it's going to take in your head. Right? You plan the amount of spins so you can throw it with like a certain amount of force and make it there. Plan the spins, yes. And so with that, with an axe, it's the same thing. Not wrong. Yeah. And so if you're going to drop dice, you have to do it in a certain way. Now, how do I know this? Because I tried to teach myself how to do it. Let me tell you, it's a lot harder with a 20-sided dice because I didn't learn how to drop dice to break gambling. I learned how to play Dungeons & Dragons and roll more 20s. But the problem is that 2 is right next to 20. So you play a very dangerous game. Yes. I, talk, I, I, I spent a long time learning how to fucking drop dice and scam people. Absolutely. That's how I know. I can I could probably hit a six on like a normal dice. Maybe like thirty percent of the time. Like something like that, like thirty not a, like and, and that's a while ago. Like uh, that that I probably couldn't do it now. I could try. I could try. Well, next time I get dice, I'll do it. Have one hundred fifty k. I can hit it one ass six times. Yeah. Buy uh, twenty one Savage's sister a car and. And her friend a car with the money that he would be winning. Okay, all generally nice, pleasant things. Yeah, they move over to a game of high card, which is as simple as it sounds. You get a mm -hmm. whole deck of cards. You pull one each. Whoever gets the higher card wins. I love this game. Yeah. It's the raw. And, and by the way, like my level of skill at this is extremely low. Like I'm like a one or a two out of ten. Like there are people that are like. Like, way fucking better than I am. Like, insanely fucking better than I am. It's a form of gambling. Unless you cheat. So let's watch right. the breakdown. No, There's no skill, though? No, it's not. Man, no, there That's is. A crazy there is, bro. Omen. That's a crazy omen. Someone in chat just said that. He read it out loud. Anyway, you see 21 Savage. Yeah. Opens a fresh deck yep. of bicycle like cards. There is. The classic, yeah, the goat, circle. bike like cards. A circle of the table. Yeah. Here. Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. You can see he hands them to one of his goons to switch it out. Here. He hands them off to somebody in his team. He's gonna put table right here. So sorry. We gotta play at least a thousand. All right, I'm gonna learn it, bro. I don't give a fuck. You're gonna lose more, so it's fine. High card. High card, yeah. And then he gets back a deck of cards, and it this is. is where the scam begins. He's looking, now, bro. The same goon who switched the cards shows 21 a Mart card as soon as Aiden isn't looking. If you're wondering, there is no strategy to this game. You pull a fucking card. The other guy pulls a fucking card. Whoever's closer to an ace wins however much you are willing to gamble. And I think they were playing for $1,000 and they upped it at one point to $10,000 a card. It's a lot of money. So why is he inspecting them so deeply? Well, he got to check the, the scratch. Yeah. We'll get to that in just a moment, but we can kind of tell already at this point that they might be marked because when Aiden looks away, someone from 21 Savage's team points to the card to pick. Bro, bro, wait, what? Ooh. Points to the card to oh. pick. Which he first, picks. I showed it first last time. Don't be Let me see real quick. And so that's 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 the scam. What he should have done is he should have pointed with his hand and then used his thumb to touch it. Cause it would have been out of the line of sight of the camera. He fucked up. He not used to it. 
all right? But how does it get found out? Well, remember, this is all happening live on stream in front of over 100,000 people. That is so many people. There's definitely people there. I used to, whenever I played Magic the Gathering, I, I swear to God, never cheated at a draft. I never cheated at a draft. And I never didn't cheat at a private game. Never, bro. I was like, that was part of the game to me, right? I'm not like, they're all playing one game, I'm playing two. <laughs> and my, my friend Eric, <laughs> we would get to the point, like by the time we were like juniors in high school, <laughs> as soon as we would draw cards, Eric would say, okay, everybody put your cards down. Zach, count, Alec, count his cards. Alec counts, he says there's nine. He's supposed to have seven. I'm like, that's crazy. I wonder where these came from. Where did those two come from? They were like, ready for me, man. How'd that happen? Or played with people who have marked cards before who are gambling addicts who know what's going on. And so some people in chat started to pipe up. And by the way, a lot of people are trying to deflect blame from Tony Savage, saying, I, look, this is someone from his team doing it, but... Look, he's obviously a scumbag for cheating with marked cards, but I, I just have to say that I think it's kind of in character. Like, you don't buy... Like, if you buy a fox, and you put the fox in your house, it's gonna do fox things. If you get a bird, the bird is gonna go, eh, eh, eh. You can't, you can't invite a dude who all of his songs are about shooting people, cheating in card games, and then be fucking surprised. He shows up, he starts cheating in card games. Like, I'm sorry. That's just the way it is, especially when it's his cards. Oh my god. Because you can, you can scratch cards. You can get, there are, there are ways that you can repackage cards. I've seen it polling king after king after ace after jack all the with that kind of money no it's a, it's obviously a scumbag like he's obviously a fucking scumbag like what are we talking about but again it's fuck it's a fucking show it's on twitch like i'm sorry i'm just i'm not gonna get like up in my fucking feelings about this it's a show it was polling king after king after ace after jack yeah. all the high cards all right and 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 uh, and we'll get to to exactly how Jesus. Aiden Ross found out in a moment. But look how pushy Twenty One Savage was to even start playing the game in the first place. Let's just call it. No matter what, at fifty k, you give it to me so I can buy your people gifts. Aiden Ross is basically saying, "Hey, let's just say that at the moment where you go from two hundred fifty k uh, owed to fifty k owed, we call it because I want to make sure I buy the car, uh, the cars, and I don't want to lose money buying the cars because they've done a lot of random gambling at this point. Honestly." It was, it, they went on like Omegle, and then they just asked who's hotter, and they were playing one to ten k per person. It's a, they're crazy people. They're crazy people. Kind of it's fucking just hype. A, I'm not gonna it's lie. Just a, crazy it's just people. a show. It's just it's just entertainment. So anyway, they shake on that. All right, cool. All right. But listen to what Twenty One Savage says here. Nice. Half hour. Fuck it. But I shuffle and I do the spreading. That's the only way I'm gonna do it. All right. Aiden Ross wants to play dice, which is basically fucking rolling dice. Whoever gets the higher number wins. 21 Savage, we're playing high card. Okay? We're playing high card. Okay, so high card they play. All right? He's smiling. Nope. And then we have the clips of 21 Savage no. constantly looking down at the cards. Say da da. Come on, put it And look how confidently, how cocky he is while playing this game. Say da da. Da da. <laughs> Fuck! What you have? He got the ace. That's some bullshit, bro. This Atlantic cheating game. Damn. Ace beats queen. It seems like he's the luckiest man on earth. I think wow. He six face cards in a row, something crazy like that. Anyway, for a moment, they He's overplaying play. it. You can't win every single one in a row. What the fuck are you thinking? You got to lose a few. Hasn't he ever... Like, there's no way the 21 Savage... Like, there's... Like, I mean, I don't know. I feel like we all cheated in school, right? Did he never copy somebody's work, like, identically, and then get in trouble for it? I think he grew up in the UK, right? 
And so, like, I'm sure 100% he fucking did that. How do you not know this? He doesn't give a fuck? Like, Dice, after Aiden keeps losing, and 21 Savage steps out. As he steps out, somebody from Aiden Ross's team comes up and says, Dude, uh -huh. take a look at these fucking cards. Scratch. But this one doesn't have a scratch and it's a king. I don't think you would do that, bro. <laughs> Dude, the moment he realizes, yeah, he's been getting fucking scammed. Now, if you don't know this scam, it's super simple. All you do is you use your fingernail to indent something. Yeah. And then the moment you do that, it'll have a mark. All right? Yeah. And so people do that all the time with cards. It's I mean, on the, the edge. Time, a bit of an exaggeration, but it's something that happens. I'm aware of this scam. I try to avoid, yeah. all right, playing with people who do this scam. I, know, I just don't play cards. I don't play cards. I don't play cards for money, bro. I hate gambling. I hate gambling. There's no way. Why would I do this? Very common. Typically, uh, typically in house games, right? You'll never get away with it at a casino. No, uh, it's just why and, you, and so you always play at a casino. You're play. And, and he verifies, and he goes through every damn card in the fucking deck that was swapped out by a member of 21 Savage's team and finds out that all of the face cards and aces were marked. So this isn't even like a... Because I, I know a bit about this. They didn't even really do a good job. That's sloppy, bro. Like, it's so obvious. Like, you're not even trying to make it... Oh, my God. That shit's so badly made. Yeah, because you have to have plausible deniability. You need to mark some twos. The cheating so obvious. Like that that's the oh I, I'm disappointed in twenty one Savage that he didn't mark the cards better. Like you spent seven years, man. I've been listening to your music for seven years, and you can't even you can't even get together a real marked card deck. Bro, Aiden Ross caught you? Come on, man. All of them. Should have cheated it was better. A scam the entire time. And during that IQ. run, I mean, they gambled on a, a variety of games, but 21 Savage ran it down from 250k owed to like 120k owed. Yeah. So he basically earned $130,000. Not right. all through the high card game, mind you. Some of it was because he was called more good looking on Omegle. Oh, right. But a lot of it was. All right. And then look at the environment of the building after he got caught. Oh. Dude, it is, whew, it is tough. It is tough in there. You want to just stop gambling now? That's crazy. <laughs> I want to read the chat, bro. I want to read the chat. I think you just fucked up, retard. <laughs> Cheating ass. Do a new card. Lol, 21 is picking high cards every time. Lol, that's crazy. Scammed, now he wants to leave. Come on. <laughs> bro, scammed on the cards. Call it even. Attitude because he got caught. <laughs> Vibes are so off now. You getting shot tonight? <laughs> Pro did not pay him. <laughs> Literal scammer. <laughs> Debbie Finna Web scam you? He acting awkward as fuck. You got him red. It's awkward now. Just end it. <laughs> oh my god. Because it is I, fucking funny. It's fucking funny, man. I think it's fucking funny. I have to talk because I'm so uncomfortable because it's so quiet. This is awkward. D this I, is dude, I just, I always find this to be entertaining. I, uh, it's just entertaining. Like, yeah, if it was me, I, I, I don't give a fuck. Awkward. Because this is 21 fucking Savage who just released yeah. an album with Drake. He did. Scamming Aiden Ross out of thousands of dollars when he's worth... The, the eight comments figures, are eight, eight something figures. Yeah, it's it's a crazy thing. To How do you do. think it's he got there? Crazy thing to do. It's a crazy thing to do, even if you're not rich. Yeah, but it's just extra levels of crazy when you are that rich, like why that famous, and also in front of a hundred thousand people. Now a lot of people have said, "Hey, this could be just someone on Twenty One Savage's team that 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 swapped it out." Sure, could be true. Why? <laughs> then no, bro. Like. Somebody on your team just randomly points to cards, and then all the cards they point to just happen to be high cards? Like, I don't know, bro. Like, is, what, has he got Miss Cleo on his team? 
Has he got Nostradamus? He got a wizard in there? What's this? He but knew. The of, of course he knew. He did inspect the cards, and he did pull only the cards that were marked because he only pulled face cards. Yeah. So it's weird. It's just fucking weird. And anyway, that was the largest ever attempted scam live on stream. So Hundreds far. Of thousands of dollars attempted to be scammed from Aiden Ross. Aiden Ross followed up today. He said that 21 Savage paid him out the original $250,000 that he was oh. owed. I don't know if it's true or not, but I'll take the man at his word. And that's that's where we left off. But I thought I thought it was a fun, interesting story as a man who likes gambling myself uh, and a man who uh, likes getting scammed. Anyway, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Subscribe. See you. Have a good one. Have Jesus. A good see you later. See you later. Don't, please uh, do not scam me. I am susceptible. Leave me alone. Thank you. Oh, my God. I, I, I think this shit's fucking funny. I'm going to be honest. I think it's fucking funny. Like 21 Savage, every song he does is about being a scumbag. Like, of course he's going to do this, man. Leaving the car, Mark Cards lying around was dumb as hell. You're going to pull the deck back and he needs to vanish after the game's over. Yeah, I, I mean, uh, it would have been funnier if he got caught in at 21. <laughs> that would have been fucking funny. <laughs> they, they play 21 and he's cheating at it. <laughs> after reading the chat, Jack, you do something for me. Tell your team to stop marking cards for me. Oh my god. You can't blame someone on the team. He closely inspected the cards live on stream. Yeah, exactly, man. Like, he was doing this shit on purpose. 21 Cabbage? <laughs> like, how do you... How do you have a marked deck? Because, like, so if they had a marked deck, that means that they made it ahead of time. It's not like they set this up in, like, a minute, right? So, like, if you had a marked deck with you... How is it that, like, and also, like, how did Aiden not tell that it was a different deck of cards? It was premeditated. Yeah. Well, what I'm saying is, like, couldn't you do a better job with the marks? Yo, Savage, why are you scamming so hard? <laughs> oh, my God. 21 Trash Talk Aiden on his Instagram? I bet he did. Yeah. Hey, if y'all think it's funny because y'all saw him do it, imagine how many others didn't see it. I mean, he's a scammer. Like, I mean, what it, what is it, right? He's a scammer. Like, it's just... To me, I think it's fucking funny. I'm gonna be real. I feel like, how is it that you didn't know this was gonna happen? You know what I mean? How is it that, like, you didn't just know for a fucking fact?